What's up gamers, GamerDad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Geralt of Rivia quest, Defeat a Boss. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so. I really appreciate the support. So for this challenge, you have to head over to the Citadel. And at the Citadel, you will find the Ageless Champion. He's the only boss in the game at this time. He is quite tough to beat. He carries a shockwave hammer and he knows how to use it. So with the competition for this challenge, you're going to have to come here right off the battle bus and be prepared for a serious battle. I've left all of my gameplay in so you can see what was involved and hopefully there's no confusion about where things are. But the key here is you need to get a good weapon or two right off the bat. You want some ammo. Ideally, you'll have shields and you're going to want to locate the Ageless Champion ASAP before someone else kills him. However, why take on the Ageless Champion yourself? And it's going to be quite hard to do that anyways. So what you'll see happens here is I actually was planning on doing the emote. And I do accomplish that. And then I decide just to take on the fight because of seeing the Ageless Champion right in front of me. But the key here is let some other people get involved in that fight and that's great. Just make sure you are the one who gets some damage and eventually land that last shot. So I see the Ageless. He's already here. I bust out my emote to get credit for that challenge. Now I can obviously tell that he's fighting somebody else based on the fact he was already fighting when I came into the room. And to be honest, I've got a crappy SMG at this point and there's very little I can do. So if he's shooting at me, I basically bail for a minute. I'm hoping I can get some good weapons. And to be honest, I don't do too well here. I come over here, as you can see, that oathbound chest is already opened. Looking around, I can get some ammo, that's great, which is at least better than having one weapon with 40 bullets. Especially an SMG, which will unload very, very quickly. But one thing to do is pay attention to the sounds. You can hear the Ageless Champion's breathing when he's not fighting someone to help you know where he is. Initially, he'll be in that what's called the throne room, which I showed you there. But once people start engaging him in battle and he starts chasing them and he gets his fight on, he's going to move around. So I come back here into the throne room area and I see another player. Now, again, I've got one crummy weapon here. And at this point, I'm committed. I want to take this person out. And there we go. So I've eliminated another player. That's great. There's some really good loot here. Now, the pressure is on because I can hear the Ageless. And I know that other people are fighting him. And to be honest, I don't make the best choices of grabbing my weapons here. I should have taken that legendary Maven shotgun. Um, but regardless, I didn't. So now I'm running around, I'm trying to figure out where in the heck the Ageless Champion is, because I can hear him. And that's why you just kind of walk around here and just keep going around until you can figure out where he is. At this point, I figure he's above me, but as you'll soon learn here, I come out here and that's when I realize he's not inside anymore. So I'm building up, I was gonna try and go up, and then I hear somebody off to the side. So I'm looking down, and this is where I see this other player. So I use that Excalibur rifle, I take out the other player here, and that's when it dawns on me this person was fighting the Ageless Champion. So, carefully listening for those, hmm, the size of the Ageless Champion, I quickly realize that, wait a minute, I should look down here? And this is actually an ideal scenario, is that I'm above the Ageless Champion, there he is wandering on down below. Sadly, I still don't have the greatest weapons. This Excalibur is great. However, I suck with the Excalibur rifle, straight up. So I do land a few key shots here. I miss a few key shots as well. And ideally, at this point, he would have already been eliminated. So the thing is, you want to try and nail him before, but as you can see, he actually comes up the zip line here, coming to get me. I do end up defeating him, but sadly, right as I defeat him, another player shows up here and takes me out. But I accomplish my quest, and that's all that matters. So, best of luck to you. I hope the guide is helpful. Please drop a like and leave a comment, and please subscribe to the channel. For defeating the Ageless Champion, you will get that back bling, which is pretty sweet. The weapons of the Witcher. Have a great day. Until the next video, this is GamerDad out.